Why is it that for every one of these sites we take out, it seems like two more appear in their place? Patience. Hydra certainly lives up to their name. I've hunted an actual Hydra. That was easier. Easier than this. I live up to my name, too. Hell of a price Crossbones put on your head. Runt. Too bad he never said it had to stay attached to your body. Well, too bad for you. Big words. For a dead man. You got one thing right today, Sabretooth. Heads are definitely about to roll. Oh, look. Another mangy stray. You smell wrong. Compared to him? Good point. Now I get to kill two runts with one claw. <clears throat> Maybe I should be paying Hydra. Like you got me, Runt. <clears throat> Go ahead. Make it quick. What the hell are you doing? Not much of a hunter, are you? <clears throat> You'd fit right in with Logan and the rest of Xavier's housebroken little pets. <clears throat> I don't think he was expecting that thing around your neck to bite back. Can he heal from that, too? Don't know. But I'm gonna make sure he doesn't. Yeah. Nice to meet you, too. Sounds like you had some unexpected visitors out there. Those two beasts came out of nowhere. Who were they? Victor Creed and James Logan Howlett. But I'm sure they'd prefer to go by their current aliases. Sabretooth and Wolverine. Those two have been at each other's throats for decades. Wolverine? Then he is a werewolf? I did not sense that from either of them. Because they are mutants. Like me. You are like them? I will not be howling at the moon anytime soon, Hunter. It affects us all in different ways. There are some things you'll need to become familiar with in our post-atomic world, Hunter. Mutants being a big part of that. A blessing or a curse in the blood, depending on who you ask. I can explain further if you must know. In the meantime, I need to look into what's happening in New York. Wolverine is an honorable man, if a bit rough around the edges. Sabretooth, on the other hand, is a homicidal maniac. The fact that he's got his sights set on you is definitely not good news. Wait, you know Logan? Who do you think first told me about you? 
You'd be surprised how many people have found their way into these woods over the years. And once they do, they tend to find a way back. I doubt this is the last we have seen of either of them. Wonderful.